the tax for so looking at all these what this task is asking us to do is to modify the constructor for the base model class to accept the positional arguments asks and the keywords arguments uh, if the keyword argument is not empty then we should use the keys and values in the keywords arguments to set attributes of the instance however we should skip the we should skip the class key if keywords is empty we should generate a new id and set the created that and updated that attributes to the time So, let's see. Hmm. So, we add the positional argument and the keyword arguments to the parameters of the constructor. And then, first, we are going to create a variable to hold the time format. Just a time format is equal to oh, good format again. See, okay, mm, why and um, Yeah. So we we need to modify the this init this constructor so that we can use keywords argument if they are provided. So we say if keyword arguments are provided. So if they are product provided. What we are going to do is um, we are going to look through the keys and values in the keywords arguments in order to grab them. So we say for key value in keyword args dot item. Then we check if uh, a key is a class. If if key If key is class, so we are now we are not supposed to assign this to any attribute. So we just we just keep it by saying continue. Then if if key we check if the key is created at. If the key is created that or the key is or the key is updated that so it means that they are expected to be you know I mean they are expected to be daytime attributes in, in ISO format. So what we are going to do is to convert the provided string value into a Python daytime using the daytime dot strip time method. With the time formal variable and then we set it as the attribute of the instance using the set attribute function just like this we say um, we're going to use the set set attribute so we pass in self and then we pass in the key if it's created that then we set it with the daytime dot trip time and then we give it we give it the 
you set it at the required format the one we were asked to set it at so let it set it at this so what happens if it's created that it's going to set it to the current date time if it's updated that it's going to send it to current date time using this format this time format variable that we created here so then now that we've said this so next thing is else if the key is not created that or is not updated that or is not the class then it means that the the key is now id so then we are going to set the attribute on the instance with the provided value so we set use set attribute we passing self we passing key and then the provider value again now if the key if this keyword argument is empty meaning the uh, no keyword argument was provided during the instance creation we will assign the values to the attributes like we did before in the previous task so we just say self.id is equal to we call the uuid dot uuid4 but after converting it oh my bad i wasn't looking so it's the same thing that we've already done here we are just push love it indent indent them correctly so that's all for this task and then for the test let's let's run this quickly um, okay i made the typo so as for the for the test So the, the test we don't need to modify nothing there because it's already set to cover whatever changes we made to the constructor. 